just uh, watching the day go by. Keepers patrolling the park. I should snoop around a bit. Some viewers have asked, how do I join the brave soldiers of the Home Army? Now, I've asked the Home Army leadership to respond. I would like to know that the Home Army has a full complement Looks like the old printing of office is pretty well buttoned up. I wonder if there's a way in the back. You know what? <laughs> Never mind. Next week? Arthur? Arthur Hastings! Lovely day for it. Don't you lovely day for it, me, you idiot. It's me! Sally! Oh, I knew it was you. I mean, the glasses, the hair, the really- You ass. How about going to the King's Road, knocking on her door and apologising grievously? And asking nicely for a letter of transit. She knows General Bing. Damn it, lads! She's Scarper! Uh. I know it was you. <laughs> <laughs> Now, now, what's all the scuffle? You've been having an altercation in the alley? Uh, nothing you need to worry about, Constable. I'll, uh, just be on my way. And where is it you're on your way to? Precisely. Just off to see an old friend on St George. Oh, well, no need to be in such a hurry. The bridge to St George is, uh, under renovations. Oh. For how long? I hesitate to prognosticate, sir. Dr. Faraday's the only one who knows how to fix the uh, ridiculous contraptions on them bridges. Word has been sent, but we've not had the courtesy of a reply. Why don't you, uh, I don't know, uh, go to Dr. Faraday's house? Because Dr. F has removed to a secret location, the, uh, location which headquarters keeps, uh, uh secret. All right. I'll ask your headquarters then. You some kind of troublemaker. Stay out of city business. I suppose if I want to go and make up with Sally, I need to get Dr. Faraday to come fix his bridge. So I need to visit police headquarters and find out where he's gone. Not risky at all. It's always a little extra complicated with Sally, isn't it?
Next time, stop after the first pint bag. forever are you all right couldn't be better thanks watch out for scurvy uncle jack says i don't think he's terribly popular I'd better be discreet about posting these. talking about lately. Remember the victory. Hello, I'm attempting to locate Dr. Faraday. Uh, can you tell me where I can find him? I'm afraid that information is not for public consumption, sir. I can tell him where to find Bobby Hickenbotham, though. Oh, for heaven's sake. He's not at a reform club again, is he? He was supposed to go to Lud's own. Well, apparently he feels so guilty that Dr. F has been deprived of the liberties, which are the birthright of every English citizen, he's gonna get his arse spanked. 
Constable Bevan, I'm not the public. I'm from the Department of Archives, Printing and Recycling. We're conducting an investigation into Dr. Faraday's handling of municipal records relating to the maintenance of the interinsular bridges. Two requests have already been sent by Miss Bing to your superior requesting this information. If I have to go back to the parade, Miss Bing's next letter regarding this apparently deliberate festinence will include the name of the last person I talked to. Will that be you, Constable, or the chap who keeps the constabulary's address book? In that case, sir, why don't you take the elevator on up to records? They'll sort you out. Thank you. I shall. What the hell is festinence? They deprived Dr Faraday of his liberties, but he made all the bridges. Percival Hastings, is it not? N no, it's Arthur. Percival went away. Odd. There are some things you think you will never forget. But then I suppose you do. I'm Arthur. Arthur Hastings. Memories play tricks on you, do they not? Day for it. Right oh. Hello? Constable Bevan said you're the chap who has Dr. Faraday's current address. Uh, uh, that's right. Uh, I've got records of everyone's address back there. All alphabetical. I'm quite proud of it. So, where is Dr. Faraday relocated to? Oh, uh, I can't tell you that. You're not a constable. <laughs> I guess it would take two of you to make one constable, if you had platform shoes. <laughs> right. Anyone else you'd like me to not tell you the address of? You're very helpful. That's what everyone says. You know, I used to patrol the street. It was lovely. Shopkeepers give you sandwiches, ladies flirt, the warm sun on your coat. One misstep and they put you in the records room. It's hardly fair. He was breathing when I left him. Where do you think you're going? We're not open to the general public. Bugger all. Germans want children. I don't know. Where are they taking them? I don't know. They won't say. When are they coming back? No one knows. They won't say. Why won't they say? Well, just shut it, Percy. Just shut it. Sorry. Till the war's over. I guess. They're losing, I think. But the radio... But, but the radio keeps talking about victories. Yes, but the victories keep getting closer to Berlin. I can't hear you. They keep winning, but they're then going backwards. That doesn't make any sense. It does if they're lying. Oh, people shouldn't lie. It confuses everything. Yes, yes, it really does.
they're alphabetical, maybe I can find Dr. F's address myself. F for Faraday. Oi! Get out of there! Shave it here, cut. If I want him to bugger off, I bet a nice bottle of scotch would help. Lovely day for it. All right. certainly does have this place organized. Dr. Faraday's in Lud's home. That's crazy. Why? And how do I get to Lud's home? Aren't they renovating it? Oh, lovely. I'm famous. Loads better. Percy was Sorry. never wrong about a thing. Agree to disagree? Be hicking both of them. He's supposed to check up on Dr. Faraday, but he's at the Reform Club instead, getting his ass spanked. Hmm. He must have some sort of ID that lets him cross to Lud's hole. Maybe I could borrow it. Is there meat 
on sale. I could take these all the time and I wouldn't have any worries. Again. entirely too good. Done is done. Nothing to see here. Past is history. Club. This is where that chap is supposed to be getting spanked, isn't it? The one with the credentials for crossing the bridge to Lud's Hole. I have the oddest feeling about this place. Like I should come back. Maybe not during the day. Thank you. 
in the manual a hundred feet back. Oh, thank goodness, said Jerry. I thought I'd... Hello. Please hold your invitation up to the camera. Oh, yes. That's lovely. Do come in. More of us every day. Lovely day for it. I suppose I should come back entirely covered in rubber. Why don't you go away? having so much fun. Nice to have a way to take people out of commission without killing them. in among pervs. On the other hand, it ought to protect me against electricity and lightning and things. better. Clothes make the man, don't they? Right. I can take his stuff and then I can walk across the bridge to Lud's home with his credentials, can't I? Lovely day for it. I hope the baker comes back from holiday soon. right now. I can't find my magic wand. I mean, I know where it is. It's in the locker, of course. But I can't find my key. And John Cleland and his friends are coming. They do so love my magic wand. Do you think you can help me find my key? I have to tidy, you see. Could you bring it to me here? Don't touch anything. It's got to be just 
so for my guests. Lovely weather. Well, hello, dearie. Is that her magic wand? I could use that as a sort of unbreakable head knocker. I have a feeling that's not what they use it for, though. Personal, 